The cult of Skaro had been created by the Dalek Emperor and were given names. Dalek Sek was the leader of the cult, and the others were named Dalek Khan, Dalek Thay, and Dalek Jast. They were, above and beyond the Emperor himself, and were designed to, think as the enemy thinks, and to imagine new ways of survival as well as new ways of killing. TV. Doomsday. By one account, the cult was formed before the Time War and were just four ordinary Daleks originally. Dalek Sek was the Dalek commander of the 7th Incursion Squad sent to wipe out the remnants of the mechanoids on Magella which they succeeded in doing. Dalek Khan was an attack squad leader of the 30th Assault Group. Dalek Thay was the commandant of Station Alpha, the most secret Dalek research facility. Dalek Jast was the force leader of the Outer Rim Defensive Battalion. After doing this, they were promoted to become the cult of Skaro. Pros. Birth of a legend. A group of researchers later claimed the cult had been formed during the war. Pros. Dalek. The astounding untold history of the greatest enemies of the universe. The cult, foreseeing a disastrous end on the Dalek side by the end of the Time War, built a void ship for themselves, which allowed them to hide away outside the universe, in the void between parallel realities. They had acquired a Time Lord prison ship, the Genesis Ark, which contained millions of Daleks captured during the war. TV. Doomsday. They leaked back into 21st century Earth, inadvertently allowing 5 million Cybermen from a parallel world to follow in the wake of their void ship and invade the Earth. TV. Army of Ghosts. After emerging from the void ship, the cult held Rose Tyler and Mickey Smith hostage while Dalek Faye confronted the Cybermen. Faye turned down an offer of an alliance from the Cybermen, prompting the Cyber leader to declare war on the Daleks, while the cult, confident in the ability of even one Dalek to destroy the inferior species, stated that he deemed the wiping out of the Cybermen to be nothing more than pest control. Sek then oversaw the pulling of the Ark out of hibernation with the touch of a time traveler, allowing the liberated Daleks to fight the Cybermen, as well as human Torchwood One personnel, for dominion over the Earth in the Battle of Canary Wharf. Through the efforts of the Tenth Doctor, however, the majority of these Daleks were sucked back into the void, with the only the four members of the Cult of Skaro themselves managing to escape through an emergency temporal shift. TV. Doomsday. The cult emerged in 1930 in New York City, where their first concern was to breed new Dalek embryos. However, they soon abandoned them to die in the sewers, as, their flesh was too weak. This failure led Dalek Sek to determine that the Daleks' obsession with purity and supremacy had brought them to near extinction, and that the only way for the Daleks to survive was by forcing them to evolve. Sek thus created the human Daleks, even going so far as to splice his own body with that of a human ally of theirs, Mr. Diagoras. To do so, the cult infiltrated the construction of the Empire State Building and set up a transgenic laboratory beneath it, TV, Daleks in Manhattan, from which they planned to use Daleconium placed on the mast as an energy conductor for gamma radiation from a solar flare to power the final experiment. Despite the arrival of the Tenth Doctor and Martha Jones, the Daleks' invasion of Manhattan began to unfold only for Sek's new human emotions to begin to change his vision for their plans. The other three Daleks ruled that Sek had gone too far and had betrayed the Dalek ethos, they stripped him of his authority and eventually killed him. Their attempt to make an army out of Sek's Dalek humans was foiled by the Tenth Doctor and Martha Jones, after the Doctor had agreed to work with Sek to make the kidnapped humans in the experiment into hybrids that were even more human-like than Sek. Sek sacrificed himself to save the Doctor's life from Thay, Jast and Khan, who then ordered the Dalek humans to take aim at him. The hybrids, however, questioned their orders and refused to fire. The Doctor revealed that his getting in the way of the lightning strike had caused his Time Lord DNA to mix with the human Daleks and that gave them freedom. Still stunned, Fay and Jast killed a few human Daleks but were killed in the process. Khan, declaring the human Daleks a failure, exterminated the new species. The Doctor confronted Khan and offered help, claiming not wanting to cause another genocide after seeing one already, but Khan once again used a temporal shift to escape. TV. Evolution of the Daleks. Khan, seeing no better way to bring the Dalek race back to its former glory, broke the time lock on the last great time war to rescue Davros from the jaws of the Nightmare Child. Davros then used his own body cells to recreate the Dalek race and rebuilt a Dalek fleet of 200 ships. TV. The Stolen Earth. 